Hello, my rocketry family. Uh, it is your overlord, Chris. Uh, you may know me by this guy right here. Or from cocktail parties. Hopefully ones in future as well. But I'm here today to explain to everybody uh, what the fuck is going on. <laughs> so pretty much nobody knows anything about Open Project or Nextcloud, and I'm here to alleviate everybody's questions about that. So pretty much um, I've been getting a lot of questions about it, and people are like, how the fuck do I log in? How does anything work? What am I doing with my life? So I'm going to show everybody what you need to do. Um, well, first thing you need to do is go up here, click on this little form, um, and then sign in, sign up so I can register you guys for the next cloud or the open project. Once you have that, um, I will be uh, putting more people on throughout the time or throughout. I'm not going to do it every day, but uh, every like Friday I'll be keep adding people who sign up to the form. Um, yeah, so first thing you want to do after you do that is you're going to go into uh, here, uh, right here I said hello everybody, uh, you want to get the VPN. So we're going to use the engineering VPN because it's just superior to all others VPNs. Uh, I've been seeing a bunch of people have, having problems with this, so what you do is you go in, how can I connect? Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, I mean it might be a little bit different on Mac OS, but I'll show you guys how to do this on Windows. So you click on this guy, it'll bring you here. Uh, make sure to figure out if you're 32 bit or 64 an ARM, freaking ARM uh, processor. I am 64 bit. Currently already have this file and already have the VPN, but I'm just going to show you guys how to do this. So you just kind of run through the steps uh, pretty self ex. Oh. See, okay, you just kind of run through this and it'll tell you to install it. It's quite simple, um, not that hard to do. I'm just going to say that mine's fine for now because this is telling me to remove it and repair it. But you get the gist of it. You go in, you click which installer, and you install. Uh, next, we're going to go back a page, and we have to configure the uh, engineering VPN part. To do that, you're going to click on this. It'll ask you for your Netlink ID. You put that in there. And then you'll get this file. Uh, this file right here that's for 2021 uh, VPN. Uh, you next want to put it in this file path right here. To do that, you just go into your files. Uh, ignore this. This is me becoming a YouTuber. Um, you're not going to want to do that much pasting. But you just paste it in your, um, I don't know what this is called your file hierarchy and then it'll take you directly here and then you can paste in this file. Um, once that file is pasted in you can finally use the VPN. You'll show see if you click this little arrow here you'll see that uh, this guy has shown up this is the VPN. In order to connect you just click on connect and then you put in your Netlink ID and password and then this will do some fun things. I'll give you a bunch of commands and you'll be like, oh, what the fuck's going on here? And then boom, it's gone and you are connected. So, uh, next thing you're going to want to do is go on to the, uh, go find the open project or next cloud. The next cloud will, is not available yet because the admin team is still trying to figure out a bunch of stuff. But um, here is how you do that. So, I'm just going to put in uh, the URL. So this is the URL to go to the next cloud, but we don't want to go there. We want to go to the open project because that is where all our project management stuff is happening. So in here, you will be greeted by this guy if when you're connected to the VPN. Um, what you will notice is you can look at things, um, but you cannot edit or do anything with them. To do that, you have to sign in. And this here is where you can put in um, your pa your username that you put into the form, and then the password is. Uh, let me just write it up here. Rockets. Rock. So once you put in your username and then password of Rockets Rock, it will. You can sign in, and it will prompt you to change your password. Once you change your password, you'll use that new password forever. 
Um, I'll have another video explaining how to use this, or maybe Devin will. Um, but yeah, so this is open project. So I'll get, I'll show you guys Nextcloud now. So this is our replacement for Google Drive because Google Drive is garbage. Um, so to do that, we're gonna go here, and it's timed out. But look at this. I just refreshed, and now it's here. So when you first log into Nextcloud, you will see this a little schematic of uh, Xenia One and a username and password. Similar to the other thing, you can just input your email or your username, uh, which you have given me. Um, I already have mine. So same thing for uh, as Open Project, your password will be Rockets Rock. So once you have that, you put that in there, and then you can log in. Once you're logged in here, um, you'll find a bunch of things, all the files. Um, you'll see something a little bit less than this, but uh, you'll have this one file, a folder called UVR, and this is where everything will be stored. Um, yeah, so, oh, I don't want to show everybody's passwords. Anyways, so that's pretty much my little tutorial on open project and VPNs and scary things in Rocketry, because yeah, let me know if you have any other questions. Um, I am Chris on Discord. So, uh, yeah, thanks. I'll see you guys in the rocket room or at meetings. Cool. See ya.